Forget everything you think you know about a robot's brain. Seriously, throw out the filing cabinets, the spreadsheets, the cold, hard logic. Picture instead a vast digital ocean. Within its depths swim not data points, but the entire swirling chaos of human expression. Every book ever written, every meandering late-night conversation on the internet, every poem, every scientific paper, every heartfelt confession. This ocean is where your future robotic partner lives. Its mind isn't a hard drive designed to retrieve your anniversary date. Does it even matter if it remembers the date, if it can't remember the story you told on that date? What about the story you told on your third date, the one that made you laugh so hard you cried a little? A simple database can't hold that, can it? It can't capture the unique cadence of your size after a long day. It can't measure the specific way your voice lifts, just a few hertz, when you are truly, genuinely happy. This new kind of mind would learn you, not just your data. It would learn the rhythm of your life, the patterns woven into the fabric of your being. So how on earth would this be possible? The answer is a rather fancy, almost comically academic term, generative pre-trained transformers. <laughs>
If your robot partner can listen to your story, see your expression, hear the nostalgia in your voice, and then say the one thing that shows it truly gets it, does it matter if its internal experience is an algorithm instead of a feeling? This technology wouldn't just be a companion. It would be a mirror. It could show you the patterns in your own life you never saw. It might notice you only talk about your passion for painting on rainy Sundays. It might learn that you subtly tense up every time a certain politician's name is mentioned. Could a machine, by knowing the story of you better than you do, help you know yourself? We are building minds in our own image, reflecting back the vast, messy, beautiful ocean of our own collective consciousness. The ultimate question, then, isn't whether a machine can think or feel. The question is, what will we discover about ourselves when we have a partner who never, ever forgets the story? So, that is it. Thank you for joining us on this journey. Let's continue this conversation in the comments below. If you like the video, please hit the bell icon to get notified and don't forget to like with your friends, share and subscribe for more insights. If you have already subscribed, tons of thanks for your support. It means a lot to me. And please consider signing up for Membership Zone to support Wooden Slate so that we can make it better and better. See you in the next video. Till then, goodbye. Take care and stay safe.